Hey everyone, welcome to Data Millennials. I'm Atul and in this video we are going to discuss about the day function in Excel and we are going to see how we can use this day function in Excel. Before we go ahead and write some formulas, let's discuss what exactly is this day function. So the Excel day function returns the day of the month as a number between 1 to 31. So whenever you have a date in a cell and you want to get the day, then you can use this day function. So it will give you the day of the month between 1 to 31 from a given date. We can use this day function to extract a day number from a date into a particular cell as well as we can also use this day function to extract an input as a day value into another function. Something like date. You can use this. You can use the date function and within that date function you can use this day function also. So this day function is usually used with the nested formulas like sum if count if so the purpose of this day function is to get the day as a number between 1 to 31 and it always return the value in a numeric format from 1 to 31 so let's go ahead and see how we can use this day function with our example so our example is to get the order day on which the customer has ordered and add four days in it to get the delivery date so we have here customer name and order date. What we need to do is that we need to get the day on which the customer has ordered. So we'll simply put equal to day and this day function which we discussed earlier in this part of video usually take one argument only that is serial number and if I put this cell B6 then it will give me the day or date of this order date so for us the output should be 30 so let's press enter okay I have used this random function here so that's why it changed from 13 to 20th so let me copy paste it as values here okay now the day function is returning 20 so let's drag this formula here so it's returning 3 now as you can see here for our order date, the format is 03, but this day returns 3. This means that this is the third day. Let's put this formula again for us here. Equal to day and the argument is the serial number, which is the only argument and it gives us the date. So we'll put the cell here, which is B8 and we'll close this bracket. So it gives us 2. This means that it's the second day. Now, for delivery date, or delivery day we have to add 4 right so what we can do here is that we can put equal to this plus 4 and now if I drag this formula for this entire table I should get the day on which the order has been placed and the day on which the delivery will be done in order to get the proper delivery date we can use the date function in this date function we have three argument year for year we will take year of this particular order date okay the next argument is month we'll put the month of this order date and for day we'll take this delivery date let's track this formula so our delivery date becomes 24th of january 2022 for this order date 20th of January 2022 so this is how you can use the day function in Excel to get the day of the month which ranges between 1 to 31